good morning everybody and happy Saturday and vlogtober day two um, and this will be the second upload like I said Monday through Friday will come live on Fridays and then Saturday you get a video Sunday you get a video today I've been up since 4 a.m. and now it's like 8 I read a little bit um, did my workout today it was tough level one was hard <laughs> Um, but I'll do level one for 10 days, level two for 10 days, level three for 10 days. Um, but it was not as easy as I thought it was going to be. It's a really good workout though, which makes me really happy. So then after I worked out, I chilled and I did do a little bit of work that I wanted to catch up on just because I was a little behind from the week. And then I went and got Steven and I breakfast. He's in there eating. I just ran out to plug in my car real quick. Um, it's almost full. I'm just gonna top it off and then Yeah, I have a couple ideas of what we're gonna get into today, but I'm not telling you to you It will feel like an organic flow, but I have a vision of what we're gonna do All right, I'm gonna go eat my breakfast too because I picked up breakfast for myself. Everyone was so happy to see you Bubby Yes, let's get a light on Let's get your spotlight on Everyone was so happy to see you He needs a haircut that's what he needs. Is today his injections? Yeah, he needs to go to the VET for an injection. He's getting a little Botox and a liquid lift around his eyes. I mean, some at 14, yeah. a little collagen, some lip fillers. Are you excited? He Are you excited? He doesn't know. He doesn't, he doesn't particularly like going to the VET, so. No, he's actually getting injections for his allergies because someone keeps licking his... Well, all four paws. All... <laughs> yep, that's you. So he's getting injections today to help with his balls. Yes, he's getting... <laughs> we'll stop at nothing to keep this dog comfortable and happy. Well, it's either he gets his... Um... He Arthritis medicine or his allergy, allergy pills, medicine. And they said that they could manage it if they give him an injection so he could take his arthritis pills and stop licking. So. Are you excited? Yeah. Also, that spotlight didn't help your graze. It didn't help your graze either. <laughs> How's breakfast? It's very good. So, for breakfast, um, I went to my favorite place. It's Village Bakery. And I got us some coffee and some oatmeal with berries on. So, I'm going to help myself to my breakfast. He'll probably have some had. leftover oatmeal. He already had his. And, yeah, we're going to enjoy breakfast. I am literally just sketching out some ideas for Vlogmas. And I was actually working on my fireplace. And I just thought I'd share one thing that I do all the time. And that is just sketch something out. I find that I can see balance and scale and move some things around. So let me show you. Um, I just sketched out literally our fireplace over there and started to think about like what I'm going for and what I'm thinking could work. So I want to swag my garland similar to how I did it last year with the really asymmetrical, really heavy um, right hand side. And then I'm thinking of a really large, dark um, deer sculpture. If you remember, I actually picked it up at Michael's and spray painted it. So I'm thinking that to anchor that right side. And then thinking of some brass candlesticks, some really like heavy knit neutral um, stockings, and then a strand of bells. For the strand of bells, I am not going to be using these. These are actually not going to stay on and I forgot to link these yesterday and I'll link them today. These are not going to, I'm sorry. These are most likely not going to stay on this strand, but I bought a set from Studio McGee that are a little bit bigger, a little weightier, higher quality for sure. Also a lot more expensive. I think those are going to go the ones I have downstairs. I also ordered more from them, but it hasn't shipped yet. I think I'm going to hang those with the stocking. Um, so that's what I'm considering. Let me go grab my laptop and show you the stockings that I'm thinking about. Steven is getting ready to take Bubby for a walk. Daddy's going to play a trick on you today. We're not playing a trick. We are going for a walk. I just didn't say what's going after. 
Bubby, when you come back, you'll look like four years younger. That's it. All right, I love you. Bye, love you too. I am looking at a couple stockings. I love anthropology stockings. So I love this one. I'm only, I only need two. So this is what I'm thinking. Like, I love that chunky knit. I think it's beautiful. I'm debating though, do I do it in this carbon color? If that is black, I don't, I think there could be something super sophisticated about it all being like a really dark, moody mantle with beautiful brass candlesticks. I'm have that's that's what I'm having the hardest time envisioning. I also think it could be odd to anchor this black deer with white scarves or these ivory ones. The other option, and it's just not the root or style I think I want, because this one feels far too busy, and it's just not the vibe I'm going for. I think, I really think, and I trust my gut, that that's the right to go with. Also, I think if those stockings are dark, those bells are really going to pop against them and not blend in. And I think there's gonna be something really beautiful about it. And how many people decorate with black? Like do, a, and how, I don't know, I've never seen an all black styled Christmas mantle that still looks festive. Um, yeah, I think, I think I'm gonna go for it. I got all cleaned up, uh, washed my hair. I shaved for the first time in a week. I've been using my like electric razor for like a week or maybe even two weeks. So I finally shaved, it feels so good. Um, I have a manicure at one o'clock because I have an event on Thursday that's black and white themed and I want my manicure to match. A couple of you have asked like why have I been having um, some nail designs put on my nails. Um, after May and realizing life is short, it's something I've always thought about and I thought it's really fun. Um, I've seen like lots of male celebrities like Harry Styles and I'm always like that's so cool. Um, so it's just something I do for fun. I don't know if I'll always do it, but I'm really enjoying it right now. And I've gotten really positive feedback from people in person and a lot of you. There are always gonna be some haters. So I'll show you it when I'm done. My girl Stephanie, she's amazing. She's become like a friend. But uh, yeah, it's beautiful out. It's a beautiful day. I got another workout in. I did 20 minutes of cardio because this morning was mostly all strength. So I wanted to change it up a little bit. <clears throat> So I got some cardio in, but I wanted to show you what the backyard looks like when I have my blankets and pillows out. So I'm sorry for the wind, we're competing with it a little bit. This year I set up my outdoor separately, so I have two sofas here and then the two chairs. And this is what it looks like kind of all set up. I don't always do fall out here, so I was really excited to do it this year. So I have um, three mums that are like this really beautiful, rust color and then all my pillows are navy blue i will let you know that they're from like a seat a season ago um studio mcgee i can't link them or i would but they're beautiful and then over here i'm so happy with how this area turned out i wanted it to feel really full and like just very welcoming so i just did like a little pathway down the stairs i have two kales and then another mom this beautiful planner that my mom did has like draped over so beautifully and you can't even see the planter anymore and then pumpkins and then a corn stalk but yeah i love this space it just feels so welcoming and great but with the pillows super cozy a great place to read so yeah, I wanted to show it to you with it styled with the blankets and pillows. Steven is still with Bubba's at the vet. I'm watching a little Dateline and that's what's going on. I forgot to tell all of you, but I made a Vlogtober 
playlist for you. I will leave it linked. It's just all the songs I'm listening to this fall or that give me like a fall vibe. I'm going to be adding to it the entire month. It's on Spotify. It's linked for you. This is the album art, but I made you all a playlist. We are back from the nail place. A book that I wanted to read in October is The Witches of New York. It came today. I cannot wait to read it. And this is my manicure. We did little dots, some white lines, and then eyeballs on my ring finger. So super excited about that. It'll go well with the theme for this week. Um, all right, I am starving. I have not eaten since my oatmeal and I only eat about half of my oatmeal. So I'm gonna have some chicken noodle soup and watch The Great British Bake Off. Steven is all back from Bubby. Bubby looks like they took 10 years off since his injections. Bubby, show them your, show them your liquid lift. Oh yes, the eyes look fabulous. Bubby, they well, could have put a little bit more filler in those cheeks. Look at these paws. Look at how disgusting they are. Don't say that to him. He does it to himself. Although, my feet... It's a seen. committed look. Well, they said it could be a miracle cure, or he might have to go back for more treatments, knowing him. It'll probably He'll want more treatments. He'll want more treatments. All right, I'm gonna have some soup and eat lunch and watch The Great British Bake Off. What are you doing? I am uh, repotting my Venus flytrap, which is, there's a little fly that's flying around my office, and I'm hoping, this is a, this is a <laughs> This was near the cash registers at Wegmans. <laughs> it was like six bucks. I'm an hoping impulse purchase. It was, an, it was a total impulse purchase. And I'm hoping they closed up because I just touched them. But I'm hoping they'll open and catch this dumb fly that's been bugging me at my, in my workstation. Oh my. All right, yesterday I promised I'd show you like a little glimpse of the Christmas decor for this year. So I thought I'd show you um, the lighting is a little off, but this has like a beautiful green and black. This brown velvet ribbon I found that is beautiful. The bells, super neutral. This is reading a lot oranger. It's actually like not as orange. It's like a tan with this frosted white. This is a much better representation of what it looks like in person. Let me see if this one. Yeah, this lighting shows them so much better. So this is kind of the vibe we are going for. It's just kind of things coming together, but there will be so many elements that are happening. But super low key, Steven just woke up from a nap. I am feeling like a nap. He just took a nap, but it is too late to nap. Does anyone have any idea what we should have for dinner? Leave the comments down below. <laughs> By the time it gets posted, it'll be way too late. I really want a salad. I was just thinking about that. Except, do we have any salad greens? <laughs> no, but we can always go out and Instacart something. No, I mean, I, not Instacart. I'm not Instacarting. No, I didn't mean Instacart. You meant Steven Cart. Insta Steven! His, his dinner, unfortunately is defrosting because I forgot to take it out this morning. So he's very impatient, but I'm sorry. <laughs> it'll, it'll be ready in five minutes. You okay with that? You okay with that? All right, friends, I think I'm going to sign off this vlog today. Um, tomorrow we're gonna do a little Halloween decorating on the front porch with some bats. We're gonna add them to the front. See you all tomorrow. Take care of yourself, take care of others, and be kind. Kindness is free. Give it to everyone. Until next time. Bye-bye. I also forgot that.